All right, I'm here at the uh, at some reservoir, and normally the water would be right at the edge of there, and it's all the way down the boat ramp. It's kind of crazy. It's very, very. Maybe it's just a like a drought type of a thing, but that's awesome. I mean, at least I'll get to throw it out, throw my magnet out further. When I, all right, I just put it on the tripod and let's get to work. hearing some thunder off in the distance. I'm just going to be out here for a few minutes. My wife is at an appointment, so... Yeah, it's kind of a stuffy day. Muggy, nose is stuffed. I hate it. Uh, yeah, usually I'm, I would be three feet deep in water right now. Kind of crazy. Let's do the double sided today just because I'll be dragging it. It's the uh, single sided is better for bobbing up and down with the dock. Even the docks over there that I'm seeing, there's usually water after, water un underneath them, but there's no water underneath them this time. Now you know it's really summer. Alright, here we go. Got a big knot. Time lapse. Kind of cool. Okay. So if anybody wants to see how I have done the uh I do the rope in order for it not to get tangled every time. So you take both ends and you, find, and you uh, just find the uh, very end of both of them. So the very middle. Find the middle, make a, make a loop, and then I always get confused at, at the very beginning. Then you start a loop, you grab this, it's way too big. Okay, wait. <laughs> Just made a mess. Okay, so you start a loop. Grab this, it comes through.
grab the remaining through every loop that you're making. And that I actually started doing that with my um, extension cord at home. That way it doesn't get tangled up every time. So my wife is already done with her appointment, so I have to go pretty quick, but um, tomorrow she has another appointment. I'm going to be probably at the same spot. If not, I'm going to be doing, or somewhere else in this area here. There it is. Just stick it in the bucket and clean it up for next time. So I'm back at the uh, boat dock where I found that gun. Uh, what two days ago something like that and I'm gonna try to try to find the other half or find something as cool Let's See what we can find Before I start I'm gonna take this out of my pocket in case I drop it or fall in I've been don't I've been known to do that Got a little warm, so I had to take off my shirt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. How it is, though. I just got a little. Maybe it's one of those uh, Slim Jim things that people pop into their cars or something. Let me see it. I don't know what it is. Let me see it. Hmm. Yeah. Interesting. You gonna hold it? It's kind of rusty. It's kind of gross. <laughs> Let's see if I if I caught anything while I'm on top okay. of it. Okay. Are we putting this in the bucket? Yeah. Yeah. On top of your shirt? I'll move my shirt here. Go ahead. <laughs> okay, that was a fail. <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna set my shirt on this. Let's see what, if I found anything on my way back over here. Feels, feels heavier, but then again, it always feels heavier for me. I'm like, oh, I got something, but I really didn't. I got a nail. That's about it. <laughs> I hope nobody, none of them poop on me. I'm hearing, wow, look at over there, hun. Off in the distance. That's insane. There's gotta be 10,000 of them. <laughs> but you asked me a question earlier, and I'll tell the. Is it still recording? Just one second. Let me come back to you. Okay. Okay, so Stephanie asked me why. I'm doing it just really close to here because uh, the, there's probably about five feet of this way and then it slants down about 40 feet deep and what I really want to see is like the stuff that, that people drop off their boat right here like if they're jumping on the dock and then they fall in with their keys or a gun apparently but yeah that kind of stuff that's why I'm doing it close to the boat dock instead of throwing it out there and pulling it back but one of these days I'll I'll be dragging it that way. So. over there. We 
wanted to go over here. I wanted to go over here to see if anybody dropped anything while they were on their actual boat ramp. See what we can find. It's really nice out tonight. It's not too windy and the water is really huh? calm. Okay. Fun to look out at the boat. Watch the boat. Just waiting. So that's fun to look at. Sun's not shining too bright right now. It's behind the clouds, but well, he found something. Found a pair of forceps. <laughs> I can use those for my toolbox, tackle box. Let's see them. Bring them over here. I can't see them very well. And they work. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> and some kind of bracket. I don't know. But I can use the... the... Are those called forceps? I don't know if those are forceps or not. Well, whatever they I are. I don't think so. It. Smell that black magnetic sand. This is a good spot, apparently. Well, for that, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Out we go again. And of course, he has his t-shirt off, even though it is not warm here at all. I have on um, a zip-up hoodie and some capris. And he's barely wearing any clothes at all. But that's as it goes with Quinn. Kind of funny to me. He is a funny, funny man. And I'm enjoying coming out with him. Like I said before, it's fun to watch him enjoy his hobby. recording for a little bit. Okay. As soon as you catch us on frame. Found a couple of bolts. One, this one I found back there, but it was in my pocket, but found another bolt here. A lot of uh, metallic sand. Um, I'm going to go over on that side and do that, but that's going to be, it's going to be shot from afar. <laughs> So here we are on the third dock. Quinn's just bobbing his magnet up and down over here. Thought I would just film for a few minutes. The wow. water. Water really is pretty. That is a lot it's of very stuff. peaceful. Let's see what he's got. That is a lot what of he stuff. got? a bolt. Well, show it this way. I got a green hook. There's a couple of screws in there, but it's like so caked on with this metallic, all the metal chips. Do you see that? Mm-hmm. But that's really cool. I got a very bright green hook. This is a, this is going to be a good spot over here, I think. Mm-hmm. Sorry about that. We're just filming the sidewalk. Like I was saying, the water is so calming. Really, really peaceful. It gives me a reason to come out here. Other than being the filmographer. And he's out again, bobbing, bobbing, bobbing. Oh, 
so today we put some fish in our tank that we've been running for about three weeks. So we got a few goldfish just to test it out and see how they do. And then we're planning a trip to a fish store that has salt water and freshwater fish. We have freshwater fish, so we're really looking forward to getting some neat fish there. Probably this weekend sometime. Maybe we'll do some filming of the the fish tank once we get some more fish in. I'm hoping to get some not really exotic, that's kind of um exaggerant, but some different types of fish that you wouldn't necessarily find in a fish tank. Uh, uh, fish, um, tanks at the local got a stores. Dock screw and a bolt stuck together. Huh. So yeah, we're looking for some fish you wouldn't find at the pet stores, so that's what I was trying to say the local pet stores. So that's what we did today. Had to go get some blood work done, no fun. Not much happening today besides that. Just take some time, time out of the day. Trying to get all that, get those things done. Had to drop my car off at the um, shop to get the oil changed, so that was another run around. Just some errands today. Boring. We're going to be cleaning the home tomorrow. Not too much to do, just some picking up of things here and there. So we'll be busy doing that tomorrow. We won't have a lot to do outside the house, so we'll have we'll stay inside and do some cleaning, probably do some movie watching, just some indoor activities. Some people behind me unloading their boat. Okay, that's all for right now. Oh, just one minute. What'd you find? Mm -hmm. Huh? Alright, so I got a license plate. I don't know if I'm supposed to put the <laughs> numbers on there, but I'm guessing somebody lost it from when they backed up in their trailer. That's hilarious. A whole bracket, everything. That's crazy. What year's on the um, tag? 2018. It's wow. probably been in there for a little while. It's been in there for a while, yeah. Oh, I'm filming the ground again. <laughs> Let's see. Show the camera again. I don't think it matters anymore. It's two year two years old. Yeah, it probably that's, doesn't make a difference. That's pretty cool. Uh, right, so I think we're about done. I got a big huge uh, ratchet boat strap type of thing. I don't even know if it works. Oh yeah it does! <laughs> That's crazy. The strap ripped, so maybe if I get, maybe if I really need it, I don't know. Do I really need it? What? Probably the boat strap. Sure, I'm sure you need it. <laughs> I can just get a new strap and I got to. Can't even it. see it. You got it all wrapped up in the. No. Oh, all right. Just the rope. It actually still works. That's crazy. That's cool. It's probably been down there since the, since the, uh, uh, what is that thing called? The license plate. Maybe. But that's crazy. It still works. Everything that I've found today still works. The forceps, the, this thing. It's awesome.